Nasikiza sasa sauti ziko huko nje. Ah, church inaendelea. Mimi nishamaliza church yangu leo. Ilikuwa home church, a freedom church Mombasa. So, I'm doing part 2 of my story. By the way, I am Paulina Wall from Anyloop Captures. Leo, nenda kuapatia my journey, like the shooting journey, editing journey, everything and everything. So guys, be ready to listen. So, I was in uh, year three, year three. I had a camera and I had good friends who were ready to support me. So I decided to uh, a team of people when you are support in future. Because uh, my class members, when you are working, you different talents. So in that team, we were five. Uh, we were three females and two males. And then, kila mtu alikuwa anajua kwa best wapi so kuna mtu alikuwa best in script writing kuna mtu alikuwa best in photography kuna mtu alikuwa best in uh, videography kuna mtu alikuwa best in makeup so tukakuja pamoja we were five as i've said earlier so i was the ceo of anylop captures um, so we decided we will be meeting twice every week uh, that was saturday and sunday and we agreed that kwa kila meeting we will be contributing 50 bob each and 50 bob ilikuwa tukisave tutanunua maybe in future tununue tripod uh, tununue green screen uh, tununue drones but the bad thing kulikuwa na wengine wako finalist tukiwa third year so haiku haiku work <laughs> plus <laughs> Kuna mse moja behind the camera, she's called Valentine. Akasema, I think I'll enlighten I don't know if I'll enlighten watu. Nili enlighten watu. Ama, alichocha watu. Kai. Akasema, that 50 bob manze, inatajirisha mwenye, mwenye video, which is Pauline, to Sarah's story. I felt bad, but I was also understanding. Because, munaenda, munachanga 50 bob every week, like twice in a week. Uh, nini ni mastude manzi, kukula ni shida, kredo ni ngori, lakini unasave, so unasikia ni kama utendo chukuyo 50 bob, wendo kule, usave unumunata biryani, Friday mojo di treat, so akakuja kwa group uh, meeting, and then she said, uh, according to her, it's not like necessary, uh, if people contribute uh, the 50 bob. So members wakasema, awataweza. But before that, we managed to buy green screen. Uh, yeah, tukotu na shoot na a movie. It was called Campus Abyss. Uh, there was a script writer. Shout out to uh, JB Studios. Ali managed to write the script. Uh, shout out to Valentine. A YouTube channel. Valentine's YouTube channel is coming. It's going to be called Rebecca with Val. So guys, mkimbie vale. Ikianza. Mum patia subscri subscription. <laughs> Mum subscribe here. <laughs> if this is something that you really want to be a part of, click on that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell as well. So to shoot Kidogo, I think to, we we did shoot uh, part one of Campus Abyss. It was so interesting. Manze, why wow, two people are talented outside here? People are so talented. It was so great and I'm happy because through that uh, we realized we have very many talents. Alafu, that was that. Uh, I met a dancing crew that was called Inferno Dance Crew. I was doing most of their shootings. Uh, there's a song they did. I did the shooting, I did the editing. 
alafu most of the events they used to call me like there's a time we went to Malindi to do some shootings that was great shout out to Inferno Dance Cream and they when you enlighten my skills my skills are um, confidence in your Zeka Zaidi, and then there was this lecturer of mine, uh, she's called um, Madam JT. Akanita, Akanambia Pauline, since you have a photography, Nataka wende pale inje, ufanyani ni unjaribu ya skills. Because Bambika was coming to Mo Technical University of Mombasa, so I took my camera, actually, I didn't take. Uh, the school's camera. I took my camera and I was doing shooting. I was doing uh, taking pictures. I was also interacting with the crew as well. Um, I met Akina Kambua. I met Akina DJ Gigi. I met so many people who were there by then, which was great. Uh, I met also some musicians. When you need to shoot, you got to me pictures out. So, and then, thank you, Sana. I think campus has really like. Even if you so so many things, if you a camera kidogo, you can do so many so many activities. I did. I also did a wedding shoot. Um, I learned so many things. And 2020 was here. Corona ikakuja. Lakini manze Corona ikuniwa. Takama tulikuwa nyumbani. But I was strong. So I thought of coming up with a YouTube channel. And then I was like, which content should I like? Should I focus on? So nikaka nikafikiria, cause people were home, we were doing home church, uh, we were not atuko tunatembea that much. So I was most of my free time I was figuring out what exactly is a fanya. So to your home church, my friends nika bring the idea to them, and they liked it. They decided they are going to help me in acting. I'll be shooting the videos, I'll be editing, but they'll try to to, to act. So nika nikaanza ku shoot kidogo. These are videos on YouTube pale. Najua wengi umeziona my small crew. Manze wameni tuambali. At least wameni patia psych. Ya every single time mimi ku shoot videos, mimi kuzipost pale. Every time niki watch. My videos, man, they, you know, my legs and increase, you know, my subscribers on on the It's always my happiness, and I really want to thank them so much. So, guys, I want to encourage people out there. When Guinea, they don't have cameras, but they really want to do something. Usikufe moyo, like usikwe discouraged. You can start with that. A phone of yours, shoot something small, post it there, and then as time goes by, you'll know what to do. Kama mimi, niko na niko na di five hundred. Kuna mtu ako na di cellar. Kuna mtu ako na mirrorless camera. Kuna mtu, as in, what ako na equipment pale inje. So ninge se mat niko na niko na di five hundred ni tuli a pale ni sfanya anything. Sai singe kuwa hapa mzi. So guys, all my YouTube. YouTubers, don't give up. For those who really want to start doing something, and the layer, and the layer, and the layer. And guys, stay tuned because more and more and more and more content is coming up. Bye for now. See you next time.